firing off a cannon to signal their arrival. These replicas of the Pinta and the Nina arrive at Neptune Park in New Rochelle. I think it's marvelous altogether, really. I've been in New Rochelle 50 years and this is the first, and I think it's fabulous, absolutely great. The ship's tour is sailing museums, allowing the public to board the vessels. Now, the Pinta is the first to arrive, and although it is a replica, docking it here in New Rochelle is no small task. Mount Kisco native Morgan Sanger is the Pinta's captain. He says it's good to be home again in Westchester. I still have to go up and see where I grew up, but uh, I know things have changed. Uh, uh, gotten a lot more gentrified up there, I'm sure, and uh, I'm sure I'll be very surprised when I travel around uh, Mount Kisco, Bedford, Katona area. The Nina, built completely by hand, is docked next to the Pinta, where the two ships will remain for a week. The spectacle is a treat for onlookers who've never seen anything like it. And we never had anything like that before, and um, it's uh, it's interesting. And um, I'm sure a lot of these young kids will learn something from it. Self-guided tours begin on Thursday with ticket prices ranging from $6 for students to $8 for adults. The ships will be docked at Neptune Park until Tuesday. In New Rochelle, Carol Wilkinson, News 12.